Hello, friends, rodents, country persons. Lanwa thine ears. My name is Sapphire Smokey the Bear. Uh, tonight we've got a back-to-back -back with two uh, friends of mine, New Life 88 versus Nidorific. It's lovely to see you, and you're looking especially dapper this evening. Me? I'm beautiful, thanks for asking. So, looks like uh, this first match of ours is to take place now-ish, scheduled for nine. And then uh, the second one is scheduled for 10.30. So, I see our hash has for us a uh, diving owl bat, a cricket leech, a dive bombing bat, and a purple sand fly. Two six-letter words, but no ouches, so this should be interesting. Okay, I'm looking in the SRL, and there's our countdown. And uh, New Life has apparently finished in first place with a time of two seconds. So that's interesting. That was a quick one. Uh, perhaps I have time to run off and grab something to eat now. Yeah, new Life, please. LUL. Indeed, a new world record. Hashtag old joke. Uh, new life uh, claiming a likely story that the timer seems to have stopped by itself. Interesting. Okay. Uh, meanwhile, they're off. Uh, new life is stream is going. Timer is going, but maybe trying to uh, sort out. Uh, what's going on with his SRL status. Uh, Nito, in the meantime, is down the climb, not using Moonfall, uh, but um, if we have something we need to figure out in the SRL, this might require a restart, I don't know, but New Life is continuing. He's heading into the parlor, giving Nito a bit of a, bit of a head start. But Nito is indeed down into Blue Brin, going to show us what item we've got first, and it's boots. Yet again. Been seeing the high jump boots uh, quite a bit at the morph item. Uh, New Life doesn't appear to be using Moonfall either. Taking his time through the clouded over tour ruins and into the elevator. Nito, of course, goes straight across the construction zone not being able to morph yet. Now he can morph. And New Life picking up his boots as well. I am not tracking this time. I'm leaving that to uh, my friend Dark. But, uh, unfortunately, this time they did not validate their runs automatically via Dark style. There was no ice beam, but uh, there are supers at the far right missiles, and supers as well at the construction zone missiles. Bringing Nido to 10 supers off the bat. Uh, unfortunately, uh, that's uh, not exactly an extremely necessary number of supers right away. He can't do too much with those other than return to Criteria and go knocking on uh, Bomb Chozo's door. But he's back up the elevator, as uh, New Life uh, may have uh, frozen for a moment. His map is not blinking. Uh, he's saying something really weird is happening. My timer is constantly stopping. Here. Well, we'll see uh, what ends up happening, if anything, uh, aside from uh, normal race progression. Nito is heading back up the climb, uh, standard uh, right side wall jumping climb, picking off uh, each pirate in his way. 
and returning to the parlor, greeted by a slew of gamers. A ripper or two, and some screes as well. Well, hopefully, uh, New Life gets uh, whatever uh, it is the, uh, the issue with his timer sorted out. In the meantime, Nito indeed goes to Bomb Chozo and locates some power bombs. Uh, fairly predictable by the logic of the SM rat. It was bound to be either power bombs or regular vanilla bombs, in which case it would have been a bomb Terizo. But Nito is uh, going for the two looks like uh, my strat my personal chosen strat with high jump the two jump alcatraz escape oh oh no no i sit corrected the three he did in he did indeed jump off the uh the wall that third time not the easiest thing to do with those uh pf flyers on samus's feet but oh and look at that space jump at terminator Speaking of uh, boots, uh, high jump plus space jump, uh, quite a powerful combination. And uh, the, uh, the high jump at first is an item that, uh, that many prefer. Uh, he heads up to the back of Gauntlet and finds uh, just a missile pack and a uh, super pack. But uh, yeah, many uh, talk about how high jump is an item that's uh, that's really uh, taken for granted when you're playing vanilla, and um, you don't realize just how much you miss it until you, uh, oftentimes, until you either get space or uh, speed booster by itself without high jump, and then it uh, stunts you a bit. But uh, new life makes way into uh, bomb chozo as well. Gets his power bombs. No regular missiles found just yet, but Nito backtracking uh, first to the dental cavity missiles, and there they are. There's uh, vanilla missiles, and uh, Nito seems to be debating for a bit whether he wants them. Picks them up as New Life gets his Alcatraz escape with nary a problem. And Nito morphs. <laughs> There's a reason it doesn't sound like Dark Chase. Uh, Nito morphs into the Bombway escape tunnel. I mean, I, I could sound like Dark if I wanted to and tried hard enough. Lowering my voice into this more pleasing register. sounding as he does like a smooth jazz late night disc jockey but, uh, for now I will sound like Smokey instead as we uh, see new life heading down the Terminator to get his own space jump and Nito putting the space jump to good use to the volcano you're far too kind dark uh, blasting the Alcoons with a missile each, which works, is even though they ooh, is even though they have 200 health. Mi oh no! Missiles do double damage on them, killing them in one shot. We saw charge, but Nito took a death. He got the save. It's no big deal. He just has to do that again. All that he lost was a little time, and ne uh, New Life is not following in his footsteps. He uh, might have allowed New Life a little time to catch up from that head start Nito had, but uh, New Life is taking a different path. We've got some early route divergence as New Life heads into Brinstar and visits the Ediconian jungle. He hops into early supers. That was a nice mock ball and is going to set off a power bomb to reveal all three items at once. There's his first energy tank at the visible Ron Popeil item, a second pack of missiles, 
vanilla. Common enough. And supers. Jolly supers at Brinstar Reverse. Nito grabs another refill at the ship, and uh, I uh, he might have saved that time. I uh, missed whether he did or not, but he's heading to the right now. Perhaps he's going to go down the red tower, or perhaps he's going to just jump straight across the moat. Uh, he has that option with space jump and power bombs. A second energy tank for new life at the uh, vanilla early supers location, and more supers on the uh, ground floor. There's yet another E-Tank at the moat for Nito, which he will grab, perhaps enticing him to continue further right. And indeed, he's heading to the ocean. He's heading back to Outer Criteria to the West Ocean as New Life descends into the first cricket pocket. Into the trap door, oh, almost falls down it but manages to grab the uh, prize, or lack thereof, regular missiles just on the other side. Regular missiles as well at the Etikun Supers, and regular missiles as well at the Ocean Missiles. So Nito is going to climb back out of the water after a nice, refreshing, invigorating dip as New Life is uh, shrugging off cricket leeches. He's going to pop by the Etacoons and not wait for their tutorial on wall jumping, as it's really rather second nature, but finds yet another pack of missiles at the Etacoon power bombs. Nito is not going to continue across the ocean, as it turns out. He is. Returning down, or not returning, as he hasn't been there yet, but heading into the Red Tower. New Life continues along the more or less prescribed path to uh, Pink Brinstar into the Decora Dance Hall. Nito's first destination in the Red Tower, logically, is Beta Power Bombs. Just another pack of missiles there, which is getting repetitive. But New Life has reached Big Pink and finds, guess what, another pack of missiles. Well, well, well. Oh <laughs> uh, yes, I, uh, I see what Chase was referring to um, by the mic icon. Apparently, uh, Darkrid is doing a uh, hysterically accurate Smokey the Bear impression. That's a props, Darkrid, that's amazing. Uh, more missiles and another E tank. At least that's something other at the uh, Alpha power bombs behind the wall. And uh, Nito gets the missiles there as well, bringing him to a total of 20. New Life is sitting at a cozy, tidy 30 missiles as, ooh, Nito gets nommed again. But uh, Spospo delivers with a second power bomb hamburger pack. A nice pack of sliders, so Samus will not go hungry. Taking New Life to 10 power bombs and opening the gauntlet in the process, although that is, uh, that is uh, a location involving a lot of backtracking just now. <laughs> oh, Dark, go on. Pish tosh. You're a silly banana. New Life hops into the wave gate and removes all three hoppers with a nice small series of missiles. Takes two tries to glitch the gate and does it nicely with the high jump setup. Finds his sixth pack of missile of supers, excuse me, as Nido space jumps across pre X ray. Not worried about a thing. Checks the X-ray item. It's supers as well, and he's going to grab them. For 15. Hasn't found as many as New Life has just yet. New Life is, um... 
doing a bit of circuitous routing about Big Pink. Now, going to visit the two Mission Impossible hoppers. Check this item out underneath. It's more missiles. Who saw that coming? Uh, Nito is back out of X-Ray. He is going to still require another power bomb for these actual PB blocks, but we'll always get it right back from that BTOM, which is the nice thing about that location. Hey, guess what? More missiles at charge. This is a... Uh... This is a seed that is already making me a bit interested to wait for the credits and count the regular missile packs. Of course, this is uh, also semi-typical SM rat logic. Oh, we see supers at the Green Hill Zone pipe and supers at Spazer as well. Uh, semi-typical in these seeds, uh, missiles, uh, regular missiles are often plenty plentiful at the beginning with uh, supers growing more and more generously handed out the further along you go. New life into the noob bridge. Need <laughs> Beamless seed. Thus far looking that way. New life following on down to the red tower. Oh yes, uh, that's true as well. Charge was at the volcano. And Nito is going to be the first into Kraid's lair. As New Life, uh, spending a super for the uh, toll into the Sloter's refill. As he felt like a bit of extra health in that regard. And uh, he, does, he does not, in fact, go to X-Ray. Uh, Nito does. Uh, expelling one more missile each on the party zone key hunters. <laughs> and vanilla crate missiles. Good luck finding another beam indeed. All right, we are going to meet three pirates and a mini crate in the uh this hostile incoming room that plays us the hostile incoming music for the first time, as well as uh pre crate the Ghidorah room which Nito finds no purchase in messing around with any uh, zebs or debus on spikes or any of that folder all. He is wandering right into the big fella's room. Entering his quarters to play a little sit the F down and do not come to a prom with me. The ballroom ceiling remains intact. The one drawback to that is you can't see the door on the other side, so... But, uh, more missile yawn. Uh, new life coming uh, back through. We're going to have a high five through this door right there. Slapping palms as Nito eliminates Minicrate for the second time and does uh, just so with the three pirates again to get back out the other way. There is the option of killing all those enemies and then opening both doors, but as it's a completely linear room, there isn't much point to that. So let's see how New Life does with the Kraid fight. Oh, and he's going to take Kraid to a prom. May I have this dance, creature that is 50 times larger than myself. Missiles at the Kraid E-Tank. This is getting a little absurd. <laughs> uh, Nito now at 35 missiles. New Life still at 30. Kraid uh, not paying off whatsoever item-wise, but necessary to head through anyway. For the first of G4-ness. And, uh, yeah, still still nothing more on the tracker with major items, except the, the one difference being Nito's charge found uh, up at the landing site, Volcano. And he's going to brave this extremely dangerous first hell run to spy any tank. 
down into Norfair. Now to have a look, uh, farming some Novas in the meantime, to have a look at the high jump area. Supers at the high jump E-Tank. He did not quite get the Nova. That's easy enough to fix. On the way back up and out from the high jump boots room, you can set off a power bomb, which will knock it out of the way. And we see screw attack up there at the high jump missiles. That'll be a helpful item. And gravity suit at the, at the high jump boots locale. Wow. How often has gravity suit shown up there? Pretty dang often. The Reaver of Cheeses is with us. We are going to have Grav Suit plus the Crazy Combo Space and Screw. That's pretty good protection, but yet still not putting any Hell Runs in Logic. None at all, as they do not have Speed Booster yet. New Life manages to polish off the Nova in uh, quick succession and open the door. <laughs> they really do, jeez. So just just two A tanks on their docket so far. Uh, Nito is gonna grab a save, so it looks as though he's gonna uh, <laughs> looked as though he was gonna check out the ice location, but maybe on the way back up business center he changed his mind, which is a runner's prerogative. So. As though he is going to check out some Meridia jazz in the meantime. Oh, yes, and speaking about the Minoracle Commodora match. Uh, well, I'll let them work out their conversation uh, about that. Oh, <laughs> he's. Amazing. We see the Varia suit at the Main Street Missiles. That right there is a taunt. That is a troll, a speed-locked location holding the other suit. Well, that tells us right away that uh, speed cannot be locked behind a hell run, and it cannot be, well, by extension, of course, cannot be in Lower Norfair. Nito is running into Mama Turtle's room next finds a vanilla E-Tank for three, a total of 399 total health. And what have we got in the wall? Missiles. Mama, you're boring today. Still no other beans in the meantime. I agree, boo missiles. Taking a hit off that pirate, of two hits actually off that pirate at 40 a pop. And uh, off the Skultira as well there. New life coming back uh, probably pretty disenchantedly from the X ray location. Uh, charge beam was at the volcano. Criteria landing site PVs, indeed. As Nito is up Mount Everest, is up the, uh, the crab shaft, and he is going to take a towel to the beach where with his metal detector he will find more lousy missiles ah yes i enjoy the layout myself nito is going to make his next destination the watering hole as new life is up the red tower is into the heck way. No issue whatsoever with space and screw. And comes into the east wing. On fire. Oh, and there we have it. There's speed booster. There's our Varia suit access. And as an extra added complimentary bonus gift, E tank number four. I agree. This uh, this could be technically a go mode. It's uh, it's a bit of a flimsy one, 
as he has 25 supers, 45, 25, only five power bombs, and no other beams. Yeah. He still has charge, though, so depending on how stellar his movement is, it, it could be a technical mode, as I say. He is going to uh, wipe out these uh, couple sizers, uh, arduous task with nothing but the pea shooter, and enter the aqueduct. We are going to have a look at the aqueduct items, courtesy of Speed Booster. Yeah, I agree with that, Cheese. We're going to have supers and missiles. A French vanilla aqueduct. As I say earlier, this is getting a bit absurd. We're, go we're going to need some more uh, actual non-ammo items after... Uh, but Nito is grabbing the save, indicating he's going to check one or both the sand pits, depending on what he finds. And we know what new life is going to find in the ocean here, just vanilla missiles. Luckily, with the grav suit, new life can get back out of that little crevice and not have to worry about the block respawning on him. Ah, uh, yes. Well, and, uh, yeah. New Life uh, probably wants to see if there's something worthwhile at the wrecked ship first. Uh, vanilla missiles at the west side sand pit. And... Nito's gonna set off a power bomb. More missiles. Um, Commodora, in terms of uh, nothing but uh, flimsy ammo, you could say that. That argument could be made. Uh, New Life is going to pop into Fantoon. I uh, I missed, actually, if he checked out what Cheese calls the spooky missiles. The ones at the uh, dead wrecked ship dormant spiky room of death. But uh, yeah, that, uh, that case could be made. Well, we found Varia. Commodora. Um, it just was not accessible at the time. It's at the Main Street missiles. Okay, no spooky missile check. Cheese is confirming for me. Uh, but uh, as New Life works his way through the Fantoon fight, Nito is going to be taking on a sea snack by the name of Atun. It is pretty troll. That's what I was saying. Quite a taunt at the time. Indeed, we found speed at the watering hole. So, Nito will be able to collect that Varia suit. Nito, unfortunately, unaware he's in the wrong area for that. And it looked like just more missiles. That's what it looked like. It could have been something else at Batuun Z tank. But Nito is using a screwing method of farming on the Zoas here. Perhaps this is why Zoa was in the hash. Yep, it was more missiles. Uh, once again, I really would like to see the total missile count at the uh, end of this one in the spoiler log. It'd be worth noting to see if we get an actually uh, vanilla game amount regular missiles, or perhaps even more. Uh, true, it's a back-to-back. -back, uh, cheese, I, I don't expect you to stay up for the entire time. Uh, uh, indeed, Cheese goes to bed and gets up early, even though he is one time zone behind myself. Uh, Nito is going to either grab a save, grab a energy refill, or both. Oh, he does not need an energy refill. But uh, he doesn't have... Well, he has, a, he has a Shine Spark method of killing Dragon if he can pull it off. Oh, she's found a house today. Guess what? Just missiles. 
at the Precious missiles and an E tank at the uh, wrecked ship Eastside Supers. As Nito jumps, takes the plunge into Dr. Dre. Sigh, sigh, more west side supers. Uh, I see now. Oh, interesting. Now we are going to have a check at the uh, no longer dormant spiky room of death. Uh, uh, and we find an E-Tank. That's uh, somewhat apropos for that particular uh, location at this point. Although this... Uh, wouldn't have made a difference with their gravity suit, but this spiky room of death does not fill up with water. And we are going to check the next one back to back. Just uh, pop through the sponge bath, wipe out a bowl. Running of the bowls. As Nito takes down Dragon with ammo. And he finds a reverse tank. He's going to collect it. With only four E-Tanks, I can't say I totally blame him for that decision. No supers. That's uh, at least better than missiles at the wrecked ship E-Tank. And New Life is going to grab... Oh, jeez, is clairvoyant this evening. Oh, so which room, I wonder, is the smoky room of death? If exists. It can't be the same as the spiky room of death. But... Ah, uh, yes. Oh, yes. Uh, Cheese is only able to use his powers when they are not, uh, completely practical. What an unfortunate turn of events. And his new life heads into the attic, which will be a breeze, a piece of cake, a walk in the park, and a picnic all in one with the space jump screw attack. Opens each door, well, each, uh, bookending door. And as Nito is, uh... Heading through the sand, he's going to have a look at the other sand pit, and he's going to find Plasma on the left side, and an E-Tank on the right side. He wants the E-Tank, and I'm betting he wants that Plasma Beam, too. More vanilla missile! The nuclear hub. The uh, attic right side. Jesus' favorite room. It is a hype beam. It's about time we found something. And we've got a couple more fun checks on the exterior of the wrecked ship. High above the uh, West Ocean. But New Life is going to run in here and uh, take a gander at the wrecked ship reverse item. That he can, Dark. He needs to uh, drop back into Main Street, of course, to get the Varia suit. Then he's, uh, then he's pretty much set. Uh, it may still want some more ammo, beam or three, but he's got 50-30. Yeah. New Life, uh, looks like takes off the high jump boots to, uh, to make these, uh, jumping morphs. He can also do a, yeah, now he's doing the other method, the wall jump. Uh... I'm a, sl I'm a little puzzled, almost, why Nito didn't do the green gate glitch through to get back into Main Street quickly, but, uh, well, maybe he wasn't confident in his green gate glitching abilities just now. Just another pack of missiles at WSR. Oh, yeah, I guess you're right, Commodore. And farming the uh, Zebos at the same time. Yeah, kind of in a precarious position. Uh, so New Life is going to back outside. As he 
Magneto goes for it. Goes actually for the intended strat to uh, oh, and <laughs> New Life runs uh, almost kind of slips off the tripper and almost does not get the power bombs in the sky high altitude there, which he wanted. And he's going to uh, find another reverse tank down here in the crater maze missiles. And that's going to bring him into the bowling alley. Another moment. Congrats to Nito with the Varia suit, putting him into tentative go mode. So he's going to be in a pretty good spot here. He's going to be able to head on back down, right back down to Norfair, depending on what he wants. Might, uh... Yes, that's reverse tank number two, Dark. Okay, I was being generous. I was being debatable. All right, well, he only has five power bombs, so Ice Beam would be really nice for Goma. He's heading through the Cathedral rather than the uh, Penetrator Great Wall B Tom Speedway. And finds the Grapple Beam at the Cathedral Missiles, which gladly take, as New Life validates his run by locating Spring Ball, Summer Ball, and Autumn Ball, Winter Ball, at the bowling alley. He does not have Speed Booster and will not miss that wreck Ship Reverse item. And will merely hop over the Gravity Suit Power Bombs to get back out of dodge. And it looks like his next destination is going to be Meridia. Once again, go mode remains tentative with only five power bombs and no ice yet. I maintain. But... More missiles at the Vanilla Ice location. Ice Ice Baby. Stop, collaborate, and listen. Well, maybe he wants to make them, Commodora. Okay, New Life finds his charge beam. He is going to head back outside, as there is nowhere else to go in this volcano, and perhaps go to Gauntlet. I believe he probably saw what the uh, the back two items were at Gauntlet. So we're gonna have a peek at the uh, front item in the Gauntlet, which uh, was the ice beam in an earlier race today. Oh, and we're getting a Krakemeyer visit. From Nito, who one-shots Croc. As New Life unfortunately finds more missiles. At Gauntlet. Nito finding yet more missiles at Croc's E-Tank, and perhaps was not intending to get those, but was just flying towards them too quickly, tried to turn around, and landed on them anywho. But Nito going to make the Reaver of Cheeses one happy fellow by placing his bets on the Eight-Eyed Gerber. Cheese and Oprah both. New Life is... Oh! I thought he might... Well, he does not have Speed Booster. I thought he might uh, check the Criteria Climb Supers item anyway. Even though he can't collect it right now. Just power bombs at Old Mother Brain. As he uh, floats back through the Tor Ruins. 
just missiles, imagine that, at Croc's power bombs. And Nito is down the shaft to check out the coastline wave item. There is new life going now, Billy Mays, perhaps? There's reverse tank number three. Oh, wouldn't you be amazing? <laughs> well, actually, you are amazing. I just, uh, I'm not, uh, you might not be able to, okay, you can't nuke. Uh, but uh, manages to break that, it, it's tricky with all the wall jumping, but manages to break that top block on the way to Billy Mays with the screw attack, finds an E-tank, and Neller missiles. Boring. Missiles that grapple. Wow, 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 wow. E tank at Indiana Jones. That is E tank number six for Nito, who has collected at least two of those three reverse tanks so far. And he's going to pop back up, and uh, one of them, uh, I think it was actually New Life, already showed us that the Croc escape item is also nothing but missiles. Uh, New Life picking up those supers at Bluebrin PBs, and uh, no issue whatsoever with these giant hoppers taking his late meme route, if it even still qualifies as a meme route by this point. Uh, well, there's an interesting question. Arc, I guess we'll find out. He has the, uh, he has the opportunity from either side with his space jump. New life is back through the new bridge faithfully executing his arm pumps. Nito is back into Croc's room, which uh, normally, otherwise according to the other rules of the game, would be playing the item drone ambiance music, but in this case, as you go back in there, is playing the regular Upper Norfair score, for whatever reason. Oh, I'm sorry, I was yeah, that's right, I was making an E tank at the Croc Escape. And Nito is returning. Uh he does not see fit just now to uh return to the business center and uh blow through the Beton Speedway. He is going to go through back through the room that is called the acid snakes for some bizarre reason, even though it contains neither of those things. And Nito ascending the nine steps, as I call it. A uh, take off on the, uh, the classic movie title, The 39 Steps. Movie slash book, one of those. Nito is into Bubble Mountain and finds Phaser, actually, uh, at uh, the Bubble Mountain bottom right. I hope he is no he is certainly not going to forget he has plasma, and has already uh, already has the gravity suit on top of that, so no suit with Meridia, but he's not. He's going to check the Bubble Mountain locales. Finding supers at uh, what... Uh, I think it might have been Cross Product who christened this room Brofist. And continuing on into the actual tank room, finding missiles and a French fine reverse tank. Well, no more of those at least. New life on up to the beach and hopefully continuing on up to the watering hole and will indeed be rewarded with his eating booster. Old room was French minute. Well, the, yeah, the back room was. There were uh, supers in the first room, but who's counting? 
Okay, Nito speeds the uh, front way through the speed hallway. Finds power bombs, a second pack of power bombs, which he will grab. New life greedily collects the speed booster, leaves the E-Tank alone. He has seven to this point. We're supers at the speed booster location. And uh, bringing Nito to 40. Oh, he uh, too has charge. Again, might still want some beams to uh, complement his charge plasma combination. It might be, if he wants to check them out now, he's going to check them now, like library books. He might uh, have a look at the wave location back out of there. And, uh, hmm. Uh, jumping off the, uh, the platform. Shout. New life. Now armed with speed booster, is going to uh, pay a call on C Snack. Yep, new life now in go mode. He grabs that bar. Thirty sixty and charge. Even if he does not have plasma yet, he might go to the sand pit. He might not. And he has fifteen power bombs too. So. Ten supers on the mini boss with the worst and stupidest hitbox in the game. Three thousand health total. Supers not doing double damage. Bot wound. Uh, Nito is going to power bomb down through Burning Man. That's uh, what I started calling that room, for whatever reason. And pillars. No need for fast pillars, he can get through there in almost just about the same amount of time with a flying uh, screw space. New Life not interested in Bot Wounds missiles. Don't need no stinking missiles. New Life is also drunk. <laughs> well, he, was, uh, he, uh, he did mention in the SRL starting to wear off. Uh, Nito debating for just a second on those uh, <laughs> mouse missiles Mickey supers decides against them and grabs some air some air Jordan on the way into the amphitheater hugging the stalactite Okay, new life is up the oops, up the happy climbing room, also known as the Alm room, and no issue whatsoever with the Coliseum. As uh, Nito is grabbing the Santo Poco save, perhaps he's a bit intimidated by the upcoming Ridley fight. Not totally certain why he would be with uh, all this protection, but uh, if he wants to save, sure. We should never hold uh, the option of saving against anyone. Better safe than sorry, and all that. And of course, uh, uh, oh, I suppose so. More <laughs> missiles of true shame. <laughs> Uh, New Life is uh, going at Dragon with ammo. A pretty sensible choice, even though he he too has speed booster. Not sure how um, how handy he is with a uh, short charge uh, mid air horizontal spark. Yes, uh, using a nice, uh, efficient technique for wiping out the Boyan goo, setting off a power bomb there. And Dragon not, not playing very nicely with New Life. Doing some 
pretty fast swoops at this point, and we are going to have synced bosses with the same boss music on either screen. New life. Ooh. multi swooping It's Nito taking on the Riddler. Um... Uh, by the way, uh, Dark, uh, I think New Life also killed Kraid, so I think that one can be marked off. Uh, New Life uh, at 340 health, but he's uh, also got uh, Dragon's tummy looking pretty red, so he's uh, doing a little goo farming. It's a little bit of ooh, ammo back there, and he takes her down takes her down to Little Chinatown. Oh, and he did get a short charge spark there. We're going to check our respective items to the left of each room. There's our reverse tank. We found a Dragon, and oh, the uh, X-ray scope for Nito, which he'll pick up because he still has Fantoon to do, and that'll make the Fantoon fight go by a little more quickly. Microwave unlocked for him. New Life uh, does not need a health refill after Dragon. He's uh, gotten back up to 420 health. Hmm. I'm inclined to say uh, that uh, Nito is, uh, has a decent lead. Um, he has Fantoon left to do, and he's coming back up from Upper Norfair, where uh, New Life still needs to get the Varia suit and go all the way down to Ridley and back up. But, uh, anything can still happen, of course. That is the mantra of these, and something we must always keep in mind. It's, uh, New Life won't check items. Well, yeah, I, I guess you... Uh, point about that and my uh my beloved smoky beam could still be vanilla actually that's the one check nito did not make before heading down into uh norfair hell here new life is uh negotiating and uh climbing hills and then he's gonna have a look at the uh sizers which is vanilla. And Nito foregoing the uh, Fire Flea item. He's just a climbing up and uh, just without a care in the world, screwing through all those flames, screwing through the Alcoons. And what are we gonna find back here? Just missiles. He did not look at the power bomb at the power bombs in jail item. Do not know what that is, but congrats to New Life, suiting up all the way. Nito is gonna. Oh, he is going to find Ice Beam indeed at the Musketeers Franker Z item. Ice in Norfair. That's going to bring him back out to the single chamber, and we'll see if he goes to wave, although that's, uh, I think that's a bit more doubtful now. New life is coming on down. Yes, not going to wave. We'll see uh, how new life approaches the situation here. He's going to, uh, he's going to the bottom of the uh, ground floor of Business Center, not to its uh, lobby basement, but uh, just to the... Tom Speedway and oh, stops to grab the power bombs and penetrates the rest of the wall. Yeah, I agree, cheese. And uh, New Life also seeing phase. He does not have plasma, but well, we'll see if he uh, considers Spazer after lower repair. 
He's going to stop in the uh, gamut nest over here. He's going to do some uh, rest up a bit. As Nito ascends to Tower Brinstar, or Swamp Brinstar. Nito is back up through Meridia, taking the uh, path of the quickest path from A to B, heading up into Everest and sparking to the hatch. His new life is through the Magdalite Tunnel, which I need to come up with a better name for. And into uh, what uh, also, for lack of a new name, is the Chronic Room. And the lavatory. Nito comes back out to the other end of Red Tower. And is going to head en route to his final boss. As New Life is doing the same. We have synced opposite direction elevators as uh, taking new life into the Hell Hall and Nito into the drawbridge here. No fast pillars on new life's end either. But it was pretty fast pillars anyway, just as Nito's was. We are going to have a double visit on the generic rodent mascot item. New Life accepts the item, where Nito turned it down. And Nito paying visit on his last boss. He will be able to microwave, as I mentioned before, when he found his x-ray. Uh, New Life will uh, find the, if he checks the Ridley item, will find X-Ray, but uh, does not have Plasma, and already uh, defeated all the other bosses anyway, so it won't matter. And no big deal, really, at all, this Fantoon fight. There it is. X-Ray selected, and... Oh, that was a quick color change. Nice, quick, brief, fan toony pack fight. Uh, New Life is into the wasteland, uh, failing to uh, spin jump for that uh, screw attack on those first couple Mega Deskigas. But actually opts for these missiles. Perhaps figuring he might need uh, what uh, what ammo he can get for the final Mother Brain fight if he doesn't get any more beams. He's got to be wondering about that. We have found uh, every beam except for mine at this point. And uh, sometimes that's just the way it goes. All right, Nito is piecing out of the wrecked ship. He is not doing the reverse ocean fly. Leave it up. Oop. Loses the uh, the momentum there. But he's going to leave it up to uh, a nice air jaunt cross with a space jump. Yeah, true. Uh, on top of which, New Life did not go to Cathedral, did not find the grapple beam, and is now, uh, as a consequence, having to do the farming in this awkward method. But, uh, it works. Nito heads into Ridley with 35-35-10. 
don't anticipating him missing that many supers, but uh, nice to know that he has backup. Alright. That is all but all she wrote for Nito. Nito is uh, on into Torian. All, well, not he, he, on his way to Torian. He is back through the Terminator. He is back through the green pirate shaft. And into the uh, one other room that allowed her to a bizarre view. Oh, uh, Ridley not playing nice with others with that tail. That tail is a real jerk sometimes. But the fight is over. So we'll see if New Life uh, takes a peek at this item or not. He uh, takes a moment to uh, rise from his morph state. He is going to see the item. He's going to see that it's Ice Beam. He doesn't need that. And Nito completes his first of four Metroid rooms. Super Metroid rooms. Almost group that second set of Metroids, of two of them. But not quite. Not a big deal. Sometimes you get your supers back, sometimes you just don't. Alright, new life is back through the flower house, back through the dojo, into the wasteland. And, uh, having fun with this, uh, elevator of death. Okay, will do, Dark. Alright. Nito enters the Sand Hoppers. Of course, my pleasure. Takes down Dust Terizo with one shot. Has turned off the plasma beam. Um, I feel like I should be able to anticipate why. New life, uh, in, the, in the meantime, not checking the Fire Flea item either. But he is going to show us what's at uh, Power Bombs in Jail. And there it is! I don't think he's going to get it, but there is my uh, Smoky Beam. Oh. How dare they put my beloved Wave Beam in jail! Do not pass go. Do not collect $200. Yep. No sale. But a uh, couple beams in Lower North Air, as it turns out. And New Life is indeed going to check behind here and pick up ice. <laughs> Wave beam in the slammer. It's true. All right, so we will let Dark know about that, and um, perhaps also about Nito's timer. Not clock. Oh, we could go on and on with that. Jeez. Okay, now Nito opts to turn his plasma beam back on as well as screw attack just as I would do. Take on Mother Brain 1. That was quick and tidy. Mother Brain 2 will follow. And now let's see. With this beam combination, would take 30 shots to do an all-beam Mother Brain 2. Uh, uses some ammo at first, so that will not be the case. Uh, New Life is elevating. Has just punched the, uh, the B button in the elevator. And 
and uh, nobody in that elevator with him. To endure any awkward silences, trying to uh, avoid eye contact, thing like that. He's back up in Meridia. He has all four bosses down. He is taking the same uh, quick route, same sensible quick route, which makes total sense that Nito did. And he's up. Nito. That's, oh, okay, that seemed to be delayed for a second for whatever reason, or maybe his stream just temporarily froze for half a second. But there it is is into his uh, stand-up animation. Pops up for the baby to latch on to Mother Brain and sit her butt on down, just as we told Kraid earlier to sit his butt on down with a quick kill. New Life is up the drawbridge, is back uh, through the tunnel and to the landing. He is gonna grab a refill. And he is going to take a save as well. Okay, good night, Cheese. Thank you for staying up and staying with us this long. Sweet, sweet dreams, my friend. Uh, GG all. Nito into Mother Brain 3, now handily equipped with a uh, grand damage dealing hyper beam, and that looked quick. New Life is entering Turian as Nito is getting his rear in gear and out of here. Down comes New Life after pressing the T button in the elevator. Nice and calm as you please as Nito is in panic mode, as it were and uh, showing why that screw attack comes in handy in uh, Escape Room 4. Let's see, is he going to... Oh no, that's right, uh, as we saw in the beginning, neither runner... Uh, New Life has picked up not uh, for beams, but charge and ice. So I do not expect we'll see any, any kinds of stand-up out of him. He has got 4070. That should be just fine. He's got uh, the backup of charge beam, if absolutely necessary. Which it probably won't be. But, well, here it is. Nito has finished in first place with a time of 1 hour, 7 minutes, and 6 seconds. GJ and JG to Nito Riffic. Give it up for him. Boom goes Planet Zebes. New Life, after the uh, non-baby skip, is facing the right direction, so lip 40 frames. And uh, uses a power bomb on the coral, something I like to do from time to time. Wipe it all out and fell swoop. There's a 45 minute IGT, Nito's side. A refill for new life. He 
is going to proceed on through to the deserted desert. And down the rink of chef. He's going to go. He's just going to run right on in and He's going to run underneath, crouch, and go at the uh, Ice Zabatite skip this way. Quickly turns off Screw Attack and gets it. Nicely done. Immediately turns Screw Attack back on. Atta baby. Now in the membrane, what I call this room. Only the uh, the big gal herself left to deal with. Wow, okay, there it is. 39 missile packs. For <laughs> a total of 195 total missiles. 20 super packs, just enough to barely gl glitch out the counter if I were to hundo this one, and 7 power bomb packs. little more time spent for him in uh, Criteria than in Brinstar. Alright. New life... Oh, Mother Brain closing in there. New life is going to want to push her back a, a little ways. So... Let's see. I think the only item we may not have found was bombs. Which were at Shack Tool. Yeah, nobody was going there. Even if they did find grapple, x-ray, and ice. Alright. New Life is expected not going for a stand-up. Just taking himself down to the standard between 300 and 400 health. And taking a little break through his cutscene. That's grabbing something to eat, something to drink, stretching, giving his legs a little, uh, a little standing, a little blood circulation. And Nito turns in a 42% performance. See you next mission, which will be coming up in roughly 10 minutes or so. So, New Life is going to uh, go ahead and finish out. Good on him, doing so. Okay, and uh, also deciding in SRF to... Um, we're going to have uh, interviews by them. It's going to be after the second race. Oh, aren't typos a wonderful thing, Dark? So, uh, one runner, New Life, validating his run, and also validating Dark Style. Nito proceeded to validate Dark Style. No one doing so... Uh, smoky style this time, but that's all right. I'm sure we'll probably see it next time. The odds are quite high. Into MB3, 36 shots with the hyper beam, no sweat, just standing in the corner and jumping around the attacks. Nope. Oh. Yep. One more shot after Mother Brain turns the reddest of the color of her hues. There. And just turns to dust like everything else. Everything else petrified into. Escape, all that's left. There's a nice room one. There's a nice room two. There's a tidy quick room three with no 
blue bomber attempts or anything fancy schmancy like that. And again, uh, screw attack helping out with or Standard right side vertical of the climb. And a parlor to uh, decide the fate of the animals. They will burn. They will fry. As will everything else left on this planet. And New Life finishes in second place, with a time of 1 hour 14 minutes, 17 seconds. Good job, and jolly going, and jolly game to new life. So, this is a double header, back to back. They will be going at each other again for game two in seven minutes. This I'll be uh, commentating again. So, uh, unfortunately, if uh, if you don't care for my commentary, you're a bit stuck with it. <laughs> but hopefully, you do. And the uh, the new SRL room is up. Match two, so I will join in there as well. And thanks so much, everybody, who uh, dropped by to spend a little time with us. We'll see you next mission. And... I presume we're going to uh, let New Life's credits play all the way out and go to his dear force. There's still uh, there are five more minutes. Nito uh, apparently finishing seven minutes and seven seconds on his timer. Which uh, Dark might want to have a look at is oh okay, and we're fast forwarding through the credit. One grand total of one charge shot in that run. 